we hold it as an inviolable principle that racism must be opposed by all the means that humanity has at its disposal. Wherever it occurs, it has the potential to result in a systematic and comprehensive denial of human rights to those who are discriminated against. This is because all racism is inherently a challenge to human rights because it denies the view that every human being is a person of equal worth with any other. The build-up to this conference has prompted an extraordinary mobilization of society in many different countries. It has raised expectations which we must not disappoint. We must join hands and work together to achieve a constructive, substantive agenda. Racism is truly a global issue, and we need it to be discussed at a global level, however sensitive and difficult that may be. Today, apartheid lies dead, but sadly, racism lives on in all regions and in all societies. It's time to acknowledge and repair long-standing wrongs and reverse their consequences. Despite what we've been through as Asian Americans and as New Yorkers, we're still here fighting every day for our shared future. The pain that I went through, it was horrific watching my brother pass away. He was tortured to death. That was a, a modern day execution. Systemic racism is a set of racialized norms that have been embedded in our law, our policy, our practices. And what it's done is really licensed atrocity. In light of these profound and wide-ranging injustices, there is an urgent need to confront the legacy of enslavement, the transatlantic slave trade, colonialism and successive racially discriminatory policies and systems and to seek reparatory justice. We forgive, but we don't forget. It's a long past. We are human beings. You know, we can forgive man to man, but we will never forget. And even those people who do it should never forget so that never again humanity will be faced with such kind of atrocity. If we don't fight together, racism will kill us all. I don't want to suffocate in a world enamored of hate. I want to breathe. I want to breathe in the sweet and rejuvenating air of compassion and cooperation. I want to live fully. I want to extend the gift of a full, unconstricted life to all people around the world. Will you join me?